Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. This is just a guy talking here, I'm Ed. So today I'm unloading a uh, load of fructose. It's a uh, liquid load. So as you can see here, I'm running, uh, I have hydraulic hoses that come off of the trailer to a super pack. And what that does is it drives hydraulic fluid to the pump that's in the belly of the trailer here. So as you can see here, this is the uh, pump system here. That's one of the valves there that drops the product down into the pump. That's my control valve right there and the directional valve as well. Uh, it's like I said, this is a dual compartment tank. So that's the valve for the front tank. This is the valve for the rear tank. So like I said, this is a dual compartment tank. This is my front container up here, compartment. That's the rear compartment back there. When we unload these tanks, it's very important that we vent the tanks. So there's my vent for that one. There's my vent for the, the rear compartment. So like I said, this is a four axle trailer. I came down with, uh, I believe it's 30,000 kgs of product. So anyways, here we have the rear discharge hose here. I had to put an adapt, I used an adapter here to make my pipe fit. Also, I had to put shims in here so the cam locks here will uh, stay closed and won't open up on me and also to help prevent the leak because uh, one was leaking, I didn't put a, a shim in there, but now it's uh, stopped leaking. You can see I have my pail or my tray there to catch any drips. And there it goes into the building there. This is also a pretty simple process. Really not much, you just hope. I guess the only thing that could go wrong is your uh, the pump fails. That could be, uh, that would not be very good. But anyways, that's uh, today's video and that's how we basically unload the uh, fructose. So uh, if you like the video, like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what you like, what you don't like. All comments are welcome. We'll talk to you later.